it is... 7.09 p.m. Just this time for your daily dose of acid games. Hi, everyone. It's me. I'm about to... Oh, my God! Get eaten alive by a chain chomp, apparently. Just kidding. I'm totally fine. Don't freak out, everyone. Yo! You want a bow? Have a bow. Oh, that ribbon! I need it! Will you trade for my dog food? Or, no. Eh? I can't believe it! You are the worst! I'm going to chase you around and nibble at your ankles and eat your entire stomach. Yes, I will give you the thing. Lucky! Thanks! Well, here's your dog food! Because that's something you wanted for some reason. It's full of juicy beef! That's not dog food, that's just normal food. Eat that. Eat that, Link. Is there an option to eat the dog food? Let me eat the dog food. Dang it. It's not an option. This game sucks. You're adorable now. Like, that actually made you adorable. I don't know how. You're literally nothing but an iron ball with teeth and eyes, but you're now the cutest. Remember that, like, Bowsette trend that was going around? You had, like, Booette and Chompette? Here's the real Chompette, guys. The OG Chompette. She's the cutest. Anyways. I'm out. I don't think anyone has asked for dog food thus far, so I'm gonna ignore that particular quest quest hook. Hey, there's only one apple now. Who's been eating all the apples? There were definitely three apples on that tree while ago, so... I mean, I appreciate that the one that you left is a red apple. Because, as we have mentioned, I have a bias for such things. But, um... Kind of want to know where all those other apples went. And, you know, whether I'm going to have to, like, do something to get them back. It seems like it might be kind of important to get that off-color apple. Seems like it could, it could totally be a thing. I can't wait to get the fast run charge boot things they're so useful for going places you know what i mean like right now all i can do is just walk at a snail's pace it sucks i think let me have more buttons i wonder i think let me have three things equipped at the same time i doubt it there's probably like some horrible game breaking stuff you could do with that option so i just have to contend myself with Ooh, was that a fish no, it's it it driftwood. It was driftwood all along. Hello. There's totally a cracked wall here. If only I had bones. But I do not have bones. I am but a man with a sword. That is all I am. There, there's no there's no hope for me at this point for breaking things. Hi, monkey. Oh, God. Oh, God. You're not nice at all. I, I can't cut you or anything. Pretty sure in the other game I could totally cut you using the power of bad perspective, but not everything's all 3D and like appropriate or whatever. Dang it, there's check. Look at all this stuff there is here that I can't do anything with. Man. Alright, I'm out. Except for this hut. What's going on here? Hello? Anybody home? Oh god, it's a freaking blue alligator with a mini beach? Can I sleep in your hammock? This looks dope. Dude, I want this in my house. Can someone make me this in my house? Except not actually, because, like, this seems like a health hazard or something. What the hell are these? Man, this is crazy. Yo, what up? Yeah. His name is Sale. What's that you have? It's canned food! How did you know I needed that? For heaven's sake, man, give that to me, please! I'm gonna lose it if I can't get that can! Wow. This guy's the worst. Um, no. You're being rude. I don't suppose I can do any good to beg. If you change your mind, tell me. Please. Please give me that dog food. Alright, well, I found the guy who wanted the dog food. Completely on accident. I wonder what he would have said beforehand about wanting meat, probably. Oh, thank you. I'll take that. Please just eat that entire... Yes. That's what I'm talking about. That is a cartoon nonsense that I want in my tunes. He is very satisfied with that medal. That was great! I know it's not a fair trade, but here's some bananas! Yum! I got two bananas. It's a good deal, apparently. Pretty sure it's not. Pretty sure meat costs way more than bananas, but... Not in Japan, actually. Now that I think about it, fruit is stupid expensive in Japan. Hey, monkey! Also, I could have just picked, like, so many bananas out here. Whatever. You want some bananas? I've got bananas. Alright, I don't think he... Ow! I don't think he wants any. Have I met anyone who wants fruit? I don't think so. I don't think so. Alright, I'm out. Ow! Jesus Christ! 
That's terrifying. How do you do that? What, what sort of natural mechanism allows you to store infinite rocks inside your weird bulbous head? It's really disturbing. These are my favorite Octoroks. These like weird round dudes with with the with the little circle mouths. Like the ones in Ocarina of Time, that timeline are cool too. You know, the ones that live in the water and like jump out and spit rocks at you. Those are dope. But I like these best. These like weird land boys. I feel like there were Octoroks in one other game that were like weird and I didn't appreciate. Breath of the Wild had Octoroks, yeah. A and uh, Skyward Sword too. But they were like, they would hide in the ground. Do like the Deku thing, kind of. Did Skyward Sword have Octoroks? I don't remember. Pretty sure it did. Oh, hey, look! It's this stupid looking... Oh, man, it's so weird how you can see the next screen. It's really not how it used to work, like, at all. Oh, cool. I found all kinds of stuff. What? What is... Oh. Great. Anyways. Uh, let's get in here. Shove that key. Don't show it, of course, because that would be exhausting to animate. And we are in. We are only two, huh? Those other those other four bars just stay the way they are, I guess. That's okay. Cause I am in it to win it. First dungeon, people. Look alive. Wow, these are way creepier in 3D. Uh, oh god, I don't like how they darken it. Like that's that makes me uncomfortable. Did you hear that? Oh, cool. I don't know how that works, but thanks, I guess. Did you hear that sound they made when they were falling? It was adorable. It's like, oh, 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 ah, ah, ah. <laughs> that legitimately terrified me. I was not expecting that. I got a compass. I can see where the chess and nightmare are hidden. Because that's a thing, apparently. Compass has a new feature. It's not new. It's it's like 26 years old. This game came out the year before I was born. Fun fact. This compass has a new feature. A tone will tell if the key is nearby. That it will. Please get me out of this hellhole where fire just is not your friend. The fact that fire is just against me is, is really bad for my health. Ooh. And it like shows me an icon, which is even better. So in the original... Right, it had this feature where you go in a room and it does a little do 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 if there's a key, right? Um, like in this room, there's there it is. I guess I just stood on a button. Yes, I know, I know. I have low battery. I get it. I'm the kind of person that waits till their 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 gas gauge has been on E for like 20 miles before they go get gas. Yes, that is me. I am that person. So just stop notifying me. Oh God, I died. <laughs> Anyways, like I was saying, the original version also had this key feature where if you walk in a room that has a key, it goes do 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 do. But there's no visual cue. Like it is a purely um, audio cue. Which means if you're, you know, somewhere where you can't play with sound, such as on a train in Japan, just, you know, random example, um, you, you don't get the benefit of the thing. Or, you know, if you're just deaf, that's the other thing about it. Like if you, if you are incapable of hearing sounds, then you're just kind of out of luck. You just don't get the benefit um, of that feature, which is really lame. But this version fixed that, which I am a huge fan of. Wow, okay. So, sometimes they do like the darkening room thing, and other times they totally don't. And they just let you walk between rooms. I got so many keys. What am I even doing with all of these keys? I could use a map. Yep. There's a key in that chest, apparently. Okay, you know, I really want to kill this bouncy thing. Thank you. Oh, God! It's a... That skeleton is the same size as me! Am I the one who died? Was it me all along? Oh, that's... I can't go in there, apparently. I'm, like, saving my key... Oh? Apparently, I was just out of range for that to spawn. Which is weird. What up? I got $10? $20. Joy. Hey-ya. Hey-ya. You know, it doesn't, it doesn't do it. I, I, I. 
I'm getting real sick of your junk, game. I know that it's low. I am well aware. You can die now. Nothing? Okay. Legend of Zelda is responsible for the fact that anytime I play any game, I try to kill everything in sight. Because Legend of Zelda taught me that if you kill everything in a room, something good could ha- I, Your whole jumpy shtick is really getting old, and now you died because- I'm about to die, friends. Did, did you notice how I'm going to die? It's pretty uncool. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, you know what? I'm not even going to deal with this right now, because I am hurting. I would like to- Oh, jeez, you're back. Oh, no. Oh, dear god. Oh, dear god. Out of here. Oh, look. There's another very bombable wall over here. If only I had bombs. I don't think I get bombs in this dungeon, do I? I don't think that's a thing. Oh, whatever. Yo, bat boy. Don't mess with the best. I'm really glad I got a heart. This means I don't have to listen to the beeping. The infamous, annoying Legend of Zelda beep. So glad that they brought it back for this for this remake. You know, it's just clearly the most important feature for authenticity's sake, you know? Hello. That bird statue looks, um, wrong. Beakless statue is saying something. You can't make it out. That's scurry. And I don't remember, I don't want to like, you know what? No, I'm not even going to, I really want to like solve all these puzzles in the way they're meant to be solved and not just in the way that I already know how they're solved. You know what I mean? Like there's something really satisfying about doing something the way the game wants you to do it instead of doing it just the, you know what, instead of just solving the game's mechanics and doing things that way. Like I, I much prefer doing things the way you're supposed to do them. So I'm just gonna wait on all that Beakless statue garbage. I, I, I feel like there's a small chance that it's impossible to get the beak without using some of the puzzles. That seems dumb. So I'm just gonna act like that's not the case for now. Hope for the best. I got a guardian acorn. I don't know why, but it did. You. Die. <gasps> is this it? Is this the beak or is this the map? It's probably the map. Like, otherwise, the map would serve no purpose. This is way too, yeah, okay, that's fair. I can press minus to look at it. There it is. Wow, this is really detailed. Um, like really, really detailed. Okay, it even shows like gaps and stuff. I would love to go here, but I don't have bombs. So I guess I'll go here? Can I like just, just like teleport? It's not a thing, I switcheroo. Nice. Oh God, get out of my face. Eh, eh, great. Um, ow. Well, you're a heart now, so I guess we're all going for hearts. Nah, nah, heart. Nah, nah, I, yeah, it did it. Oh, and it actually gave me hearts. That's, I don't know if that always happens or if it's because I did heart. I'm gonna assume it's because I did heart because that's more fun. I got a beak. Sweet. Now to find an owl statue to fit it into, like the one that's literally right here. And on your next dose of acid games, we're gonna hear what this owl has to say. Even though I'm pretty sure what he has to say is what I used to solve that puzzle, which is really dumb. I'll see you then. Bye.